Customer service on my director call. Yeah, do you, well, listen, I'm trying to go in there, and uh, there's, like, so many people, and I'm trying to buy plywood. Hello? Do you want to know if we have some? Well, I mean, I was there, and there's a ton of people in there. What's that about? It's because it's the hurricane, and people are trying to buy things. Yeah, well, I mean, that's not convenient to me. We can't control the customers in the store, sir. Well, can you, I mean, how much is how, how much plywood you guys have left? Do you know the item number? Plywood? You, want it? you know what plywood is? I know what plywood is, sir, but we have different type of plywood. Are, why are you, are you angry? Are you upset? Are you scared about the hurricane? It's okay. It's going to be okay. Don't worry about it. No, I'm not, sir. Okay. All right. Well, what do you mean is different? I don't know the barcode for plywood. That's pretty ignorant. I mean, what do you think? Do you know the item number? That's what I'm asking because there's different type of plywood that oh, we have. Oh, God. Is there a man there who might know what you're talking about? What I'm, you. what I'm talking about? We're going to I think she's a little frazzled milkman. And I number. Don't yeah, hey. Number. Can- Listen, there's too many people here. This is too many people. I need Where's to get, I need to get plywood and I don't have time to be waiting for all these people here in the way. Uh I don't know who you are or where you are. Where are you at? Well, I was in the store. I came out to the parking lot to cool down. There's too many people. Um the the only plywood I have is under the canopy. You can drive right up to it. <sighs> all right. That's um the only plywood. All right. Well, how do I put plywood in a Honda Civic? What do I do? Uh, you go rent a pickup, I guess. I mean, I tried that, too. I tried that, too. And they said, no, they're out. They're out of pickups. Yeah, well, there's there's much I can do. Well, come on, man. I'm not from here. I don't know what to do. I'm from Arizona. You think I've ever seen a fucking hurricane? Uh, thanks for using the F word. Goodbye. Oh, shit, cunt. Pussy. Fucking pussy, bitch. That was Ted Webb. Call? Yeah, I need plywood. Why aren't the people answering? And why are there so many people there? Okay, hold on. Hey, help. Help me. Lumber, this is Steve. It's an Elmer's Yeah, Blue. listen, Elmer's Blue. I don't have time for this. I need to get uh, plywood. Just, just drive your tr- car underneath the canopy. I have a Honda <laughs> Civic. You don't understand. Okay, well, I cannot put any lumber. I mean, if you can get your lumber on top of your Honda Civic, it's not my job. To buy you a car or whatever. I'm not asking you to buy me a car, jackass. I'm asking you to do something to reinforce it. Well, I can. We can probably find some rope or something you can tie it to. How's that going to keep? To, how's it going to keep it from bending down the, the hood? Under the canopy. The Go hood ahead of the car. the car under the canopy, and then let's see if we can figure it out. God damn it! Fuck okay. shit! Fucking bring, shit! I'm scared about this hurricane. I don't know what to do. What do I do? Bring the car under the canopy, and I'll be waiting there for you. Oh, okay. God. What color is the Honda Civic? It's white. Okay, bring it under the canopy. Hey, it's, it's white like your ass. Just bring bring it under the canopy, and we'll see what we can do for you. It's white like your ass. All right, I'll do that. Thank white you. White like my ass. Yeah, okay. white like your stupid ass. I hope you drown. Just bring it under the canopy. We can help you out. All right. I hope the hurricane blows you away until the can water. I have a hug? Are you still in the parking lot? Just bring your car under the canopy. We'll see what we can do. I'm here right now. Okay. Bring it under the canopy. Let's see what we can do. Okay. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. We'll bring it, bring it let's go. Let's go. Just bring it under the canopy. Let's go, let's motherfucker. Can... Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Just bring, just yeah, park it under the, just bring it under the canopy. All right, I'll bring it down. Listen, okay, you, yes. you, you put it under the canopy. Can you put it in the back seat? Something with orange stripe around it. Can you what? Yeah, it's, it's, you called Home Depot. You didn't call Lowe's. Oh shit! Well, that's what the problem is. <laughs> okay. All right, so Home Depot, you have wood still. Yeah, yeah. Just but if you're at, at Lowe's, they've got some under the canopy. You can just pull it over. I was just over there. What were you doing over there? Because it's right next door. Oh, you're scoping out the prices, being a little sneaky spy. No, we, we're not that busy. You better not. You hear me? You yeah. stay over there on your side, motherfucker. You. <laughs> I'm glad they record all these things. It's funny as hell. <laughs> well, I'm glad to record this too, asshole. Yeah, thanks for using all that nice language with us. Shit, fuck, cunt.
vagina, labia. Tell him I need a hug. Ejaculation. <laughs> Call back any time. All right, buddy. Hey, is uh, Larry there? Uh, no. You know who I'm talking about? No, I don't know. I didn't even know that Larry works in this store. Do you know a Larry? No, I don't. No. I've got three people that have worked in this store next to me listening to this that have been here since day one. Yeah, they but don't that, know a Larry. Yeah, but they're women. Uh, one of them is. Hello, C. Put her on. She can hear you. I have it on okay. speaker. We've got, we're blasting over the whole store because there's nobody in here. You're a stupid woman. <laughs> you hear that, Lucy? Yeah. Sounds like he likes you. Yeah. All right, I like you. Yeah, go fuck yourselves. Go, go to hell. Go to the hell. Listen, I was just, just at the Lowe's. I was at the Lowe's, and they ran out of um, plywood. Hello? Yeah, you just called Walmart. Yeah, yeah I know. we don't have plywood. Do you have, uh, or do you have desks and stuff there, though? We have desks, but the desks are pressed wood, yeah? But it's something, right? I mean, I don't know what to do. I can't find any plywood in town. Uh, my wife's yelling at me, carrying on, do this, do that, get the effing stuff, get the effing windows covered up here. We're not from here, you right? You understand? We're from Minnesota. We've never seen a hurricane before. We don't know what to do. Are we going to die if we don't have it? Are you in the house? Well, we're on an Airbnb. And we've been trying to contact oh. the owners, and they won't say S-H-I-T to us, you know? And we're Christians. What we, kind of windows do you have? I'm having heart palpitations, and, like, my left arm <clears throat> is numb and tingling. <clears throat> what kind of windows do you have? Uh, just glass windows, I don't know. I mean, they're just, like, is big. Is it jealousy? Well, it's, it's big windows. <clears throat> it's a, they're, like, they got, like a, like, a tic-tac-toe board in the middle, you know? It looks like a tic-tac-toe board. Okay, hang on. <laughs> you can use the furniture. Hello? If you can't get um, plywood or anything like that, the best option would be to tape the windows. Oh, come on. And have draperies. Tape the windows. That's, some, that's like 1980s crap. Now, what's that going to do? It will stop the window from shattering into a lot of pieces. Well, I, keep it, I don't want it. it I don't want it. I want to put up wood. I need to put up wood. How many? Well, you, there's no wood. You got desks there, don't you? Come on, he hung up on me. Hello. Hi. Oh shit! It was milkman. Oh. Hey, listen. Uh, this is pickup. Oh, you want pickup today? Hang on. Well, yeah, I need a pickup. I need a pickup. Uh, I need to get a pickup for plywood. We don't have plywood, sir. I told you that before. No, but listen. If I can just, he hung up right up on me. 24 hour, okay, yeah. you. Are you really 24 hour? Or are you going to be open during the hurricane? We're going to close 12 o'clock tonight. Oh, no. Then, oh, no. Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, and we close at 12 midnight. Shit. When are you opening? Uh, we open Friday morning, 5 a.m. Okay, yeah. Fi- yeah, I'm here. I mean, are you really going to open or are you just thinking? No, we're going to open. Oh, man. All right, do you have pickup? Pickup? Uh, yeah. Pick up? Yeah, do you have a pickup service here? Yeah, you have to go online and order it online. All right, well, I need, to get, good- I need to get plywood. You understand? I called Lowe's, and they said... Yeah, that we don't have plywood over here. I'm trying. If you let me explain. They said that they have pli- oh, yeah. they have plywood at the uh, under the canopy in the parking lot. You understand? But I've showed up in a Honda Civic, and they're like, "You can't put plywood on that. You need to come back in the pickup." <laughs> yeah. So, how much do you lease the pickup for? For an hour? Do you do by the hour? By the hour? No, this Walmart. Yeah, they but it's, have plywood. It says on the website that this Walmart has pickup. Yeah, we have pickup, but we don't carry plywood at all. I don't need the plywood. I just need the pickup. I need to get the pickup for an hour to go pick up the plywood at Lowe's. No. Hold on. Stupid. God damn that hello. buzz from hell. Hello? Are you there? Yes. Yeah, listen, I'm about to have okay. a panic. I'm having a going to have a panic attack about this hurricane. Uh-huh. All right, so I went to Lowe's, and they have plywood, because I know you guys don't have plywood, and Home Depot yeah, ran out of plywood, but they have some plywood. They're holding it for me. So I showed up in my Honda Civic, and they said, no, you got to 
You got to, um, they said for me to go get a pickup, you know, to put it in. So, uh, so a I, I, yeah, but you have a, you have pickup there, right? I was on the website looking for pickup in Honolulu and it said Walmart has pickup. It said that this Walmart yeah, location has pickup. We have, we have pickup, but we don't. That's what I need. Well, I mean, how much is it an hour for a pickup? Is it free pickup? I, it says free pickup. No, it's not. We don't, we don't pick up other uh, we don't pick up products or items from any other store. No, I'm going to get it. I just need to, to rent the pickup so I can do that, you know? I mean, that's great that you guys have... No, we f- don't... It's not... Do you, have um, a, do you have any pickups? We don't rent out... We don't rent out pickup trucks or any kind of vehicle. I know. It, sa- it says free pickup at this Walmart. Yeah, it's, is not, it, it's not vehicles. Is the pickup available? As, no, we don't have the vehicles. That, come on. We don't. I mean, are they when 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 are they? If you don't have them now, I mean, I'm guessing that people are getting plywood. When's the next one coming no, in? When they say when they say pick up today, that means you come and pick up your item from the store. You have a pickup now? Not, today? What time? We don't. We don't, we don't rent out pickup trucks. I don't need to rent it. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. You know. Get, I'm gonna use it. And I'm going to keep it. I'm going to keep the plywood at home. I'm going to put it on my windows. But we don't, we don't do services for that. Oh, come on. Come on, please. I know it says right here you have pickup. Please just let me... I'll, I'll, is there so, uh, is pickup meaning it's for pickup your items that are ordered online. All right. I just went by right there and I saw there's a few pickups in the parking lot. Obviously, one of those I can use, right? I mean, no. come on. Walmart does not provide pickup services like now, that. Now, what are all these pickups here doing in the parking lot here? It's for, it's for, listen, those are for, um, those are, they're, they're not with the company. We we don't own them. Those, they're there because it's, um, for shelter reasons because of this, Hurricane. Oh man! But okay, it even says automotive here. Like I'm looking, it says auto center. Yeah, they're not. They're not. Those trucks are not associated with Walmart company. <sighs> Shit! You know I'm getting real mad. I'm gonna start kicking cars here until you. You better do it right now. Oh, go ahead. Fine. <clears throat> Oh shit! All right, all right, all right. Okay. Can you turn off this alarm on your pickup here? Hello. Hello. <laughs> okay. I don't know if she believes that or not. Thank you. Thank you for calling. Hello. Hi. Hi. How are you? Hello. Hi. Pizza Hut. Yes. Hi. Yeah, I'm really, uh, I've just kind of been stressed out with this whole hurricane coming. I'm not from here. I'm from Arizona. I don't really know much about that. Um, so, uh, I mean, are you guys delivering right now still with everything going on? Or? What island are you on, sir? Uh, I, you know where Papipi Road is? You're on Oahu in Never Beach. Yeah, that's all I know. Yeah. I'm, I'm literally here on vacation, and I don't know what to do. The airport is all booked up and closed, and I can't get out. And I don't... You know what I mean? We don't even we don't even have a, a like a refrigerator here. I can't. And then the the store shelves are all empty. Did you want to place an order? Yeah. Well, I gotta ask though. Like, so they're saying we're, how long we're supposed to save food for? Like two weeks. Wait, wait. wait. This is this is Pizza Hut. Are you pranking me? No, 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 no. Okay. I'm on vacation. So I'm, I'm on vacation. I'm, sure. I'm staying on. I can't oh my you. god. Sir, I cannot advise you on hurricane relief, but I can take your pizza order. If you let me finish, if you let me finish and not be rude, how long do the pizzas keep at room temperature? Because what I figure is I can buy a few pizzas and we can eat off of that for a few days, you know? Because I wouldn't I wouldn't be able to answer that, sir. Well you're pretty ignorant. Is there a man there that can tell me? Excuse me? You're pretty ignorant. No, I'm not ignorant, sir. You're Mm. ignorant and you're wasting my time. You're stupid ignorant. Thank you for calling Pizza Hut. This is Jackie. Could I please start with your phone number? Yeah, what's up, my Kanaka? How you doing? Was I just talking to you? Uh, no. Okay, I had a question. There's a hurricane coming. I'm on vacation here on the big on Oahu. Okay. 
Okay. All right. And we're trying to find, like, we don't even have a refrigerator here. And then we tried to get some stuff to, like, eat. And the grocery stores are all, like, cleaned out, I guess, because it's a hurricane. I've never been in one before. Um, how long did the pizzas hold for? Because I thought maybe my wife was thinking maybe we could order, like, a few pizzas and they might keep for, like, a day or two at least. I uh, wouldn't keep them for two days. Um, what would you put on them? If you maybe got vegetables, they'd last longer. Well, I th- but... you don't think they'll get soggy with the vegetables? Maybe if I just got cheese, plain cheese. I don't know. I don't think we could say that they could last two days Shit. with no refrigeration. Shit. Oh, I mean, you can't say that. I know, I know. Well, at least it'll get me through one day. Because I eat cold pizza all the time. It's okay to eat pizza the next day, right? Yeah, but if it's been refrigerated. Yeah. When's the hurricane supposed to hit? I believe tonight. Oh, shit. I don't know what I'm going to do. All right. Are you guys still delivering? Uh, Yes. All right. What time tonight is the storm? Okay. All right. Okay. If I can get an order, I need one pizza with heat. I'm sorry? One pizza. With heat? One pizza with heat? Yeah. What do you mean? Like heat? Make Put hot on it? You mean spicy, like jalapenos? No, temperature. I want a hot pizza. I want it hot. Okay. All right. Did you want to go ahead and place the order now? Yeah. All right. And your delivery address, please? Uh, I want to pick it up. I can pick it up. You know where Papipi Pap- Road PP Road? Eva Beach? Is that? I guess we're here staying at Eva Beach, yeah. Okay. Yeah, now, is, is that fucking place open? Because they put boards up all over the place here. They're open until 4. But, uh, is the door open, or how do, I, how do I get in? Yeah, you walk through the door. Okay, and... But, I mean, is there wood on the door right now? Or is it open? I don't think there's any wood on the door. Okay, alright, and then... Like how do how do I uh, walk? Like what do I do? I put one foot down on the ground. You know we have enough going on without this kind of nonsense. Thank you very much. Big deal. Goodbye. It's just a category four. It's a glancing blow. Get out of here, lady. I lived through three hurricanes in a row in the space of two months, motherfucker. Hello. Thank you for calling your Petco and Baratania. This is Sean. How can I help you? Thank God you're open. Uh, I'm staying at a Airbnb here in Honolulu. Okay. Okay, and so I went to get uh, food over at the Safeway, I guess it is, like a couple grocery stores, the Longs Drugs, uh-huh. and they're completely out of what we need. Like, they don't have anything. There's, uh, what's going on? I guess there's a, a storm coming in or something? Yeah. It's like the biggest hurricane that we've ever seen. But, yeah, yeah. Well, I just got off the plane today, and the next thing I know, like, everyone's panicking and there's no food. So, do you have canned food there? Uh, dog or cat? Dog food. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to... Um, how long can, can I survive off of that? <laughs> what, are you, what are you talking about? Well, I went to the grocery store and to the 7-Eleven and to the Long's Drugs, and they have, like, nothing in the canned food okay, aisle. Okay, so you have nothing better to do than to prank call a Petco? Well, you guys have food. Hey, you guys up. have dog hey, food, hey. right? I have a dog. He needs food. Asshole. So how long can you survive on it? Well, I mean, if we need to dip into his supplies, I mean, it's either if it's us or him, it's going to be us. Fuck this dog, you know? Your mom. You really have nothing better to do. Survival we need to eat. Fittest. We need to eat, man. Well, Listen, lady, survival of the fittest. Yeah, I mean, if it's between me and the dog, I'll... I'll so, I'm, do, you, do you actually have a, have a question for me or no? Yeah, all right, so then what's what's the best way to prepare the dog then? If we're going to just have to eat him, I guess, if you want to sell to us. Cock sucker. Cage win. Yeah, hi, I need a, I have a question. Do you have a... Is this line available if I have questions about the hurricane? I'm from Arizona. I've never lived in one, and I'm on Iwa Beach, I guess it's called, Papipi Road. Uh-huh. And I'm kind of scared. Is there a member? Uh, is there a meteorologist or someone in that department I can uh, talk to? Our weather guy is on air right now, but um, do you have a phone book? Well, I mean, let me ask you this. First of all, I thought these were called typhoons. What happened? 
Um, no, here it's called hurricane. It's oh, I thought they were called typhoons in the Pacific. No, no, no not here. All right. Is, am I going to be okay? Like, am I going to die? I don't know what to do. I don't have plywood. I try to get plywood, and I don't have a pickup. Um, I think you'll be fine as long as you, as long as you have your supplies. I don't. That's the thing. I don't. I have a hotel room, and I mean, I have an Airbnb, and I don't have any supplies. Nothing. Like food and water? Nothing. There's nothing here. They shut, they're going to shut the water off, they told us. Oh. Uh, they shouldn't be shutting the water off. Well, the owner called from, from he's on vacation, and he's renting out the place to us, and he called, and he said, I, you know, he said, like, motherfucker, you, he said to me, that I get the fuck out of the house, he said. And, you know, I'm like, what the fuck do I do? You know, and then he was like, you motherfucker, I'm going to shut the water and the power off, he said. To get us out of here, he said he was going to do that. Um... What do I do? What do I do? That, but there are shelters open um, if you no. need to go to a shelter. Um, um, yeah. Distant. Where I'm from in Minnesota, on our news station, we have um, Channel Six on your side, where they help uh-huh. you. They help you in cases like this. Can you? Is that guy available? Maybe to help me out to get some plywood or something. Uh, we don't have anybody available to do that. Oh, come on, honey, baby. Come on. This is a. Well, you have you have the information. You're the keepers of the information. Right, and so there are shelters available if you need a place to go. Yeah, but I mean, it's like dirty people there, right? No, not necessarily. Well, I mean, it's like poor, dirty people. I mean, is it going to be like Hawaiian people there? Um, that's very unnecessary, sir. What uh, I mean, the my uh, my na- the neighbor here was like, stay away from them. He said Kanakas or something like that. Kanakas. Okay. I'm like, what's that? And he said, you know, you know. And he he made his eyes like squinty. Okay, I gotta go. Bye. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hi. I have an issue. All right. So I'm in an Airbnb, and I'm not from okay. here. I'm from Minnesota. Okay. All right. And I've never, I don't know Hurricane for shit. I'm sorry for cursing. I'm just real nervous. I was so nervous. That's I took, okay. I took a basketball, squeezed it so hard, it exploded. And my glasses are messed up now. I almost said the F word. Um, okay. So I don't know what to do. And they were suggesting maybe call you guys to get some What island are you on? I'm on, uh, do you know where Papipi Road is? No, I don't. Not off the top of my head. What you Eva, know what Eva, island Eva, 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 All I know is it's Eva, Eva Beach. Eva Beach. Oh, okay, you're on Oahu. Oh, sh- is that where I'm at? Okay, yeah. I just got here to Air and B and uh-huh. we contacted the owner, letting them know, hey, like, what do we do? And the guy, he he, put right. his, he said you're he said you're effed. They said F U C K D O S. He said you're F U C K E D. Oh. He said, and he said he's on vacation. Uh-huh. Don't bother him. And then oh he threatened to get the electricity shut off. He said he was going to call in and cancel the electricity if we wow. if we called him again because we called him like three times. Like, listen, like we're you know this isn't fair. Like we yeah, need to. Yeah, you're worried. Well, and then he he said to get plywood out of our ASS. He said to me. Oh. Yeah. Wow. Okay. So am I? Okay. Are we going to die without plywood? Um, Eva Beach may get a lot of rain and wind. Oh, 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 oh God. Yeah. Um, oh, 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 do you know what channel oh, to watch? Oh, do I what? Um, do you, are you watching TV and getting updates? Well, that's the thing. He shut it off. He shut off the cable. He shut off your cable. He call. He said he was calling. I thought he was just joking. He's like, I, I'm going to call the cable company now. They're going to shut off the TV first of all, and if you call again, I'm going to have them turn off the the electricity. I'm going to call the power company, and I said, you try. They won't come out and do that. Uh, but then the next thing I know, the cable went out. I don't know if it's it was him or maybe maybe he yeah. did it or maybe it was Is just the a weather quiz. bad right now where you are? Yeah, we got there's like a there's like a foot of water outside the door. It's raining. Yeah. Okay. Well, there's waves uh, coming in. There's a lot of waves coming in. Oh, there's waves coming in. Yeah, we're right on uh, the beach machine. Okay. Can I have your phone number and your name? Uh yeah yeah give me give me a second here uh okay f- f- let me see in the good working number here four zero five okay three nine six 
Okay. 6884. 6884. What's so your name? It rings here, but the problem is that it's uh, it's like his business, so it says like front reception, I guess, when you call, but that's it. It, it rings here, though. Oh, that's that's his phone number for the house. Yeah, the that's house that you're at. here. Yeah, because we, ourself, we have we have a service. It doesn't work. We have Guardian oh, okay. Guardian Mobile from Minnesota, and they don't have any towers here. They're a small company. Right. We're from the middle right. of nowhere. I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know. We're going to die right. probably. I guess we're going to die because I don't know what to no, do. No, there there's nearby shelters that you can go to. I'm sure. Um, you know, dirty people. Okay. Um, so you can either stay where you are or go into a shelter. All right. So the shelter may be better than where you're staying since you are close to the water. Right. So if you can, do you have internet access? Well, no, I have nothing. Okay. Let me look up what's closest to you. One second. And we have five dogs. Yep. They're, they're pet friendly. Okay. Um, I'll find you a pet friendly one. Damn it. God damn it. All right, and the, uh, uh, let me ask you, because the neighbor, he said to watch out for ca- Canicas, he said. Uh, I don't know what he meant. Um, he said, if you go to the, he said, he's like a redneck guy. He's like, if you go to them, their shelters, you got to watch out for them. Canicas, Canica, something like that. And I'm like, he's What's probably that? referring to local people. Well, because, um, yeah, you know why? Because it's like, what's that? And he's just starting, he's like, huh, 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 huh. and I'm like, what's that? What's a whatever? And then he said, he 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 put his hands like on his temples and he stretched his eyes so they were like slanted. And he said, you know, you know. He said that is, oh, that's what he meant. Oh, yeah, wow. Um, but it, it's fine. I mean, we are normal people. There's nothing unusual. Okay. I'm going to find you where you go, okay? One okay. second. So you're a, you're, what do they call Kanaka? 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 <laughs> um, yeah, I, I wouldn't say that, <laughs> but yeah. Why? What's that mean? <laughs> it's Kanaka, and it's just a local person. Kanaka? Um, Kanaka, okay. Yeah. All right. Um, okay, let me check. I'm going to say that now when I get there. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Are you touching the computer? Yes, yeah, I am. How many penises are on the computer? I'm I'm trying to help you. Okay. I'm trying to be professional. Okay. I'm gonna put Campbell my I'm, I'm, I'm gonna put my brother Major Tinnitus on line. He's over um. He uh, works over at Hickam Field. Uh huh. He's a major at Joint Base Pearl Harbor. Do you want to? You could. Could you stay with your brother? Well, they won't let me there because I'm not, you know, military. They said, the guy. Oh. He, he was like, "Get the fuck out of here right now!" Uh, uh, uh. The guy tried to go okay. there. He was like, "Give me your identification, a- like that." Man, he he pulled out his gun. And he started shooting it in the air. And then he um. Okay. There was like an oil you drum. You have a pen and paper. There was an oil drum. He started shooting at it, and it caught on. It blew up, and it caught on fire. Okay, so you can. Are you ready to write down the name of the school? And the helicopter crashed. There was a Black Hawk helicopter, and it was flying really low. They were like, "We need to evacuate from hurricane." And um. The the guy at the gate was shooting the gun in the air. And it crashed. I'm sorry. I'm really busy. Are he, you ready to write down the name of the school? And then he said, I got five. Okay, I'm sorry. I got I'm five really stars sorry. now. I got five stars. And he started. Okay, thank you. Uh, he got in his Karuma and he was just driving his Karuma. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. GTA 5, everybody. <laughs> Hi. This is the arcade. Yes, it is. Okay. All right. Do you do a background check if I come to eat there? A background check for eating here. Yeah. Absolutely not. Oh, Should we? Good. Do you need a background well, check? Well, I'm just I'm rubbing my thighs as I'm saying this. Uh, this is a step up from repairing broken vibrators and Sibians. Are you guys okay with hitting, like, single moms, hitting on single moms and stuff there? Do you get a lot of, like, uh, military wives? Can you repeat that again? Just one more time. Do, uh, do you get a lot of military members there? Any veterans? Uh, veteran discounts or anything like that? We do, 
every Monday we get military discounts, 10% off all purchases at the cashier station. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. Do your do your computer machines use tokens or quarters? We use tokens, sir. Okay. How many coconuts do you trade for a token? Did you say coconut? Yeah, because I don't know what kind of money you use in this country. What do you call them? Are they like uh, coconuts or pineapples? What's the conversion? It's U.S. dollars. We're a U.S. territory under the United States. Oh, okay, yeah, but it's not like really United States. I know you guys have like your own president here and your own money system. Sir, do you have an education? Uh, yeah, obviously. Okay, so we are U.S. territory under the United States. If you look up Guam, that's very nice. That's very nice. Yes. Yeah. All right, so my. Uh, my neighbor here, he's American, he's from Texas, and he was telling me, like, he said I had to be careful for those people, and then he, he put his hands on his temples, and he pulled it back so that his eyes went up, you know? And he and said... where are you from? Huh? Oh, I'm from Minnesota. Oh, so you haven't ever left your state then? No, no, this is the furthest west I've ever been in my life. Okay, it makes a lot of sense. Uh-huh. So, yeah, do you know what he meant by that? Like, you, are, you do it with me. Like, put your hands on your temples, your your palms, and then pull back. And then look at what you look like. And he said that those are bad. He said those are dirty people, bad people. And he said, put well, your, when, if, he, he said when you see them, you put you your wallet like, in. Huh? If you feel like we are, are the people on this island, the U.S. territory, we're look crazy doing that then you can go ahead and look in the mirror tell him to look in the mirror and it'll be the same way we all look alike well no i mean my my eyes don't my eyes don't do that naturally i actually have to pull it back like that maybe you don't is that why oh that's why you don't you're one of those people those people i think you need to Go back to school and get some education and not be so ignorant. To well, the I, I have an MBA. Have I have an MBA. Hi. Hi. Yes, representative. Hi, I'm a person. Okay. Oh, good, good. I thought you were a computer. Um, I'm ordering my girlfriend a bra machine. I'm sorry, what was that? I'm ordering my girlfriend a bra machine. Uh, we don't have machines. Well, that's what I call them, you know, because they, they kind of hold them back, you know? Oh, gotcha. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um, it's inside joke. Oh, gotcha. Okay. Uh, give me one moment to pull up the website. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. And then, do you know what uh, style she wanted? Um, well... I mean, should I describe what she's talking about? Uh, yeah. Okay, it's on her upper upper ventral region of her torso. Wait, I'm I'm sorry. Can you repeat that? It's supposed to cover the uh, the upper ventral region of her torso, and it serves as her mammary gland, and it produces and secretes milk to feed infants. Uh, real quick, I'm going to place you on a brief hold. I, I think I'm having. But um, it it developed it dev- she developed them from her embryological tissue, and at puberty, her estrogens in conjunction with growth hormones caused her caused her breast to develop. You that's related to our company because if not, I'm going to have to end this. Well, I've been waiting. I had to make an order. You said you had to talk to your supervisor. What's going on? Um, I am a supervisor. Okay, so let's take my order. Why am I talking to you anyway? Um, um, uh, what would you like to order? Uh, 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 I need a bra for my girlfriend. Okay. Do you know what size you would like to order? Okay. So here's the information she gave me. All right. She, she, it's located on her upper ventral region of her torso and it serves as her mammary glands and they produce and secrete milk to feed our infant. Hello. Yes, I'm, I'm waiting to um, get some information. Yeah, okay, so then, I'm sorry, I thought you hung up on me. So both, uh, no, I'm still here. I mean, I have these also, but they're not as big. 
And they, she told me that they developed from her embryological tissue and at puberty and mm-hmm. that estrogens and conjunct... Sorry, did she go... F- no, you're still there. Hello? Ma'am? Hello? Hello? Okay, I'm going to have to end this call because clearly... What do you keep hanging up? anything to do with our business. Well, th- um, hey, so wait a minute now. This that- is a bra company and this is for... This is what I'm saying. Exactly, she- and I can also hear you calling other companies as well. No, no, no. Um, no, 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 no. You're hearing things. things. You're a liar. You're a you're a dumb woman. Okay, thank you. Have you're a stupid. Great- why why is there a woman manager anyway? Get out of here! Finally, she hung up. God damn it. Um, we're a long term care facility, so we're like a nursing home. Oh, so you can't massage me on my sciatic? No. Then. No. Well, then why didn't you tell me that before, motherfucker? You? I. Tr- I tried to. Well, god damn it! That's the problem. Why we got to answer to a woman? Is there a man I can talk to to complain about you? Um, excuse me? Is there a man I can talk to to complain no, about you? No, there's not. Okay, because I, you can't even understand how business works. I'm trying to talk I to you in business terms. I to explain to you that we, I told That's you nice. twice okay. that we're That's nice. home. That's nice, huh? I'm very nice. Very good. Okay, honey, baby. Very nice. Very good. Yeah, is can I talk right, to? A I'm man? gonna hang up. Cause you're very inappropriate. Can right I now. talk thank to you. not woman right now? Okay. <laughs> Shit. She's Hello, I want to thank you for calling in to order Sheik's performance bedding. My name is Deborah, and I'm gonna help you get a better night's sleep, just like they showed in that commercial. So I'll be able to see you with your order today, and we will record those call. Is that all right with you? That's fantastic. Thank you. Awesome. So I'm glad you called in because we have an amazing promotion going on. Did you by any chance hear the promotion code on the? show that you watched yeah yeah i did she used by the word sheiks and then some number after that did you hear one uh yeah the number after it is six nine one two four all right let's see if that if that code is going to do us some good all right and so you you saw the commercial. You know that these are performance sheets. They feel amazingly good on your skin, and they are designed to allow air to flow and circulate for a cool, dry, comfortable sleeping environment. And each set that you're gonna that you buy has the bottom sheet that's fitted and has an ultra thick elastic on it, so that it will mm-hmm. fit nice and tight, snug, no matter how thick your your mattress is. Shut and you get a flat off. sheet and two pillowcases. All right. So, and we also ship them, and we ship them to you for free. So there's no extra charge oh, there. Sure were you were okay. you calling in to get the the price on a certain size? What kind of bed were you thinking to buy these for? Uh, well, I have a king. I have a king, uh, and then these it's sheets a, are going to be for work for work purposes. For work purposes. Yes. I'm not sure I know what that means, but they're going on a king or a California king, but not a split king, No, no, king, no right? re- re- regular king. I'm not a homosexual. I don't have a California king. Okay, so a regular king bed. So let me see. That's so right. normally the king, oh, my gosh. So normally the price on a set of king-size sheets is $258. But today yeah. with that special promotion that we were talking about, it's one forty nine twenty five. Shut up! So you, can, it, you can go ahead and charge me the two fifty eight. Like I said, it's for, I'm going to write it off as a work expense. Well, I can't charge you the two fifty eight. I'm going to charge you one forty nine twenty five for a set of sheets. Ah, uh, well, now this if is starting to sound like a scam. What? They're on sale. That's my point. They are on sale. So yeah, you're but, the but sale I don't. Price. I, you know, I don't pay sale prices. I pay full price. I'm not a. I'm not a stupid ignorant. I'm not. You know, I'm not cheap. I'm not poor. My name is Dirk Diggler. And I I fucking make pornos, and I need these sheets at full price. I'm sorry, I know I, can know how, how, I know I know how to do karate. God damn it! I could order you two sets if you want to spend more money. I can get you a mattress pad. No, no, no! Pad. I, I didn't know. I don't want two sets. I want one set at full price. Okay, I can't do that because the computer is going to calculate it with the sale. I can't do anything about that. Have you ever seen um, one of my movies? No. I doubt it. I don't know, but I doubt it. I'm very popular. Uh, my name is Dirk Diggler. How are you? Okay, but Dirk, so Dirk, um, I would love to send you a set of sheets. I could send you more than one. I can send you a pillow. I can send you a mattress cover. They all feel amazing. They're really good. I just can't. I just oh, can't. Have you tried? Have you tried them yourself? 
Yes. Oh. Oh. Okay. So how do they perform? Right. So they feel nice and they're cool when you're sleeping in them. Let I don't me, know how they perform get a, for you. Let me get a second pair. Because uh, I need to get a, I need to get a pair for Roller Girl. What color would you like? They come in. We have four colors. We have your normal bright white. We have graphite, which is like a nice gray color, kind of a medium density gray. We have acru, which is kind of a uh, parchment color. And we have navy, dark navy. Shut up! Uh, I'm going to go with dark navy because I want the uh, stains to show up so I can show that I've actually been working uh, so they don't try to, you know, lay me off or anything. Okay, and what credit card would you like to use today, Dirk? Oh. Uh, let's see here. I'm going to use my Master oh. Visa. Your MasterCard or your Visa? I thought I heard oh. both. Uh, well, mine's a, yeah, mine's a hybrid. I have a Master Visa. Oh, interesting. So it, does the number oh. start with a 5 or a 4? Oh. Uh, here, it starts with oh. a 4. All right. So it's actually oh. issued by the Visa company, but that's okay. Can you read okay. me the number? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's uh four oh. nine one six. Yeah, man. Three four yep. seven eight zero six. Oh. Three, three four seven five. Oh. Huh? I'm sorry. I, I, oh. The sounds in the background are louder than your voice. I don't know whether we turn you up I'm, or it down. I'm well, no, I'm working. Yeah, I, get I can't it. turn her down. Okay. Um, so the telephone, uh, the number I got, I got as far as the four four nine four seven, and then I couldn't hear any more. What's the rest? Yeah, uh, eight eight zero six nine. That worked. Expiration. Oh. Expiration. Oh, it, it expires eleven of twenty twenty two. And the magic three digit code off the back. Uh, six four nine. All right, so oh. we're good with the card. Is, and you, did you tell me the billing address is the same as the shipping address? Oh, yes. Yeah. All right, so first name is Dirk, D-I-R-K. Yep. And how do you spell your last name, sir? The D. D-I-G-G-L-E-R. Oh, so beautiful. All right, and your billing zip code then is also 90001. And your billing address... It's going to be 43511 is going to be my zip code. Oh, oh, it's going to be Yeah. 43511. Okay, and your billing address is? 105 Lowland Drive. Shut up! M-O-L-A-N-D? L-O-W-L-A-N-D, and that's drive. God right. damn it, woman, I tell you what, you listening to me. I'm live on a street. L O L A N D Drive in Custer, Ohio. Yeah. Lowland, yep. And are we shipping these to Ohio or are we shipping these to LA? No, no, these these are going to Illinois. I don't know where you're getting Ohio from. Yeah. I put in maybe I got the zip code wrong. I put in four three five one one. Is that incorrect? No, that's right. Four three five one one comes up as Custer, Ohio. Uh, it's Bellet, Illinois. I'm guessing we have the wrong zip code. Uh, What's the name of the city? Because she's stupid. Yeah, she's Excuse me. If you would like to speak to me that way, it's not necessary. I was about to try are to you, look it up with you. What is you the name of the city again? What is the name of the Shut your mouth and I'll tell you. B-E-L-O-I-T. Yeah. Asphalt. Beloit, Illinois. I know there's a yeah. Beloit, Wisconsin. There's also a Beloit, Illinois. Asshole. Yeah. <sighs> my dick's hard. <clears throat> oh, my God. Well, so that gave me a completely different zip code. It gave me 61080. Is that correct? Uh, not by my recollection. Okay, hmm. so... At the moment, the the important thing is that the billing address needs to match the credit card that you just gave me. And I'm not sure that we have the correct address. Please record your message. When you've finished recording, you may hang up or press 105 Lowland Drive in Custer, Ohio. Are you are you an ignorant? How how long have you lived in this country? I think we're finished with this call. You've been a busy 
beginning. I'm going to terminate this call. You can speak with someone else. Bitch. You've been incredibly rude, and I don't Bitch. care. Bitch. Have a great day. Bitch.